Brokti Hawa Brokata Yehosha Brokti Hawa Brokata Yehosha Bahasham Rakakodash. The bondage to the apostles, the elders, salutations to you, sincere brothers, teaching and truth and sincerity. Lesson will be entitled Everything Out in the Open. The focal point for this lesson is going into the assassination attempt in regards to King James by sourcewikipedia.org. Guy Fox mask, also known as the V for Vendetta mask or anonymous mask. The movie V for Vendetta highlights Guy Fox and anonymous utilize this mask as a representation for them. And they were inspired by the movie V for Vendetta. And again, this movie highlights Guy Fox is a stylish depiction of Guy Fox, the best known member of the gunpowder plot, and attempt to blow up the House of Lords in London on 5th of November 1605. Second source, chick.com, article entitled, Was King James a Homosexual? It might also be mentioned here that the Roman Catholic Church was so desperate to keep the true Bible out of the hands of the English people, Israelites living in England, that it attempted to kill King James and all of Parliament in 1605. In 1605, a Roman Catholic by the name of Guy Fawkes, under the direction of a Jesuit priest by the name of Henry Garnett was found in the basement of Parliament with 36 barrels of gunpowder which he was to use to blow up King James and the entire Parliament also known as the House of Lords. After killing the king they planned on imprisoning his children re-establishing England as a state loyal to the Pope and kill all who resisted. Needless to say, the perfect English Bible would have been one of the plot's victims. Fox and Garnett and eight other conspirators were caught and hanged. It seems that those who work so hard to discredit the character of King James join an unholy lot, the grave. Gunpowder Plot of 1605 and earlier centuries often called the Gunpowder Treason Plot or the Jesuit Treason was an unsuccessful attempted regicide against King James I by a group of English Catholics led by Robert Caspi who considered their actions attempted to renocide and who sought regime change in England after decades of religious persecutions. So those niggas were going off and King James wasn't having it, okay? He was giving them hell. He was a defender of our faith. Owing to concerns about collateral damage, an anonymous letter of warning was sent to William Parker, 4th Baron Montego, on 26 October 1605, who immediately showed it to the authorities. During a search of the House of Lords in the evening on the 4th of November 1605, Fox was discovered guarding 36 barrels of gunpowder, enough to reduce the House of Lords to rubble and arrest him. Most of the conspirators fled from London as they learned that the plot had been discovered. Trying to enlist support along the way, several made a last stand against the pursuing sheriff of Worcester and a posse of his men at Hobeach House. In the ensuing gunfight, Caspi was one of those shot and killed. At their trial on 27th of January 1606, Eight of the of the surviving conspirators, including Fox, were convicted and sentenced to be hanged, drawn, and quartered. Okay. 
and a major focal point. It might also be mentioned here that the Roman Catholic Church was so desperate to keep the true Bible out of the hands of English people, of the English people, that it attempted to kill King James and all of Parliament in 1605. Let's go to... Revelation 16 and 13, and I saw three unclean spirits like frogs come out of the mouth of the dragon. The dragon is a representation for the pagan Rome Empire. The three unclean spirits represents the three city states. Okay, you have the Vatican for religion, you have London for finance, and you have Washington for military. And out of the mouth of the beast, the beast is a representation for NATO and the EU and out of the mouth of the false prophet. The false prophet is a representation of the Roman Catholic Church. Okay. Second Corinthians 13 and 8. For we can do nothing against the truth, but for the truth. And the reason why King James was not assassinated, because Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, had him protected. Okay? He had work to do. All right? And he is a member of the elect. So it's nothing Satan or Esau, which is Satan's physical counterpart on earth is nothing these entities can do to the nation of Israel beginning with the elect because everything okay is predestined by Yahweh Bahashem Yahweh Shah all right and his words just manifest on earth okay as he chooses all right again this is um part two just highlighting um some circumstances going into the life and times of King James. Lord will, I will do a part three tomorrow going into a prophecy of King James. Lord will, you're edified. Shalom.